Hey, what is up? It's your girl Kabira, aka Bira on a budget. Welcome back, sis. Okay, to another beauty, fashion, lifestyle, okay, video. All right, sis. When you get a little bit of beauty, you get a little fashion, and you get a little bit of life. Just sprinkle right there on it, like this, like this, like this, like that. <laughs> <laughs> if you are new to this channel, go ahead and hit that like button, okay? Go ahead and leave a comment down below. Let me know if you are ready to hear how to get out of a toxic relationship, sis, because it's about time. It's about time. You should have been left yesterday. But we starting today, so that's all. That's all that matters. We starting today. So, roll up my sleeve. Let's get it cracking. <laughs> And if you are not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, okay? And join the sisterhood, okay, sis? All right, let's go ahead and get into this video. This is how to get over your man, your girl, your bae, whoever, okay? How you get over this toxic relationship, okay? Because, you know, I've been in a good one, two, three, four, three, not trying to make a fourth one toxic relationship. Okay, all right. Hey, it's time to get over them. Okay, boo boo boo, let's go ahead and get into it. Let's get into it, let's get into it. So if you didn't see my last video, how to get out of a toxic relationship, I'm gonna put that video right here. In this video, we're gonna talk about how to get over them, okay? We're gonna say bye, 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 to your ex, okay? The first tip is to grieve. Grieve the relationship, okay, sis? You need to let it out, okay? You need to inhale. Hoosa. And exhale that bad energy, that toxicity. You need to get all of it. Get rid of all of it, period, okay? And you do that by letting it go, okay? You might not be comfortable with crying or whatever, but you need to address it. You need to grieve the relationship. A lot of people say, well, you know, you gotta go in there, sis, okay? You gotta cry it out. Sometimes you just gotta let the tears flow. And you don't have to be hard all the time, okay? I know you wanna be tough. I know you wanna be tough, but sometimes you gotta be, you know, you gotta be sensitive. You gotta let it go. You gotta let that thing go. Cause if you don't let it go, it's gonna build up all in you. Okay, messing up all your good vibes and your good energies, honey. And we don't want that. We don't want that. No, we don't. Okay? So go ahead, cry it out, scream it out, whatever you have to do. Let that stuff go. Let it go, sis. Let it go, let it go, can't hold it back anymore. Isn't that what your girl Elsa said? Let it go, okay? Second tip, tip number two. You need to evaluate this relationship, sis. You need to... <sighs> That's how I'm gonna think from now on. Bow! So... You need to evaluate the relationship. Like I talked about in the first video, you need to be honest with yourself, okay? So this technique is something that I used when I was trying to get over my exes and trying to, you know, figure out why I keep jumping from relationship to relationship. And so I romanticize a lot of my relationships a lot, y'all. Like, I focus heavily on the good times and I don't focus too much on the bad things or like the reasons why I was so frustrated or why I had to leave that relationship. I didn't want to acknowledge it. So I was so focused on the good times and not focused enough on the times where my needs weren't being met. And that's the most important part. So, blah, 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 blah. But you need to evaluate your relationship, okay? I'm gonna give you three questions. So question one is gonna be, were my needs being met? Question two is, what was I asking for and was it realistic? The third question that you should ask yourself is, do you even like this person? So I need you to ask you those three questions, okay? Write them down, get your little notepad, okay? 
<laughs> get your little notepad write them down and figure out if this person really was somebody that you really wanted to be with okay so when i was evaluating the last relationships i've been in my issue was i was too focused on them i was too focused on their feelings their emotions how they felt about the situation when I wasn't putting myself first and putting my feelings first. How do I feel about this person? How is this person making me feel? Hey, the person that I'm with considering my feelings and my emotions. That was the questions that I had to, to continuously ask myself to kind of get myself out of that romantically, that, that little bubble I had myself in. Evaluate it for face value. Don't romanticize it. Don't think back on the good times. Think about the bad times. Think only about the bad times, okay? They're going to get you through, sis. The bad times is what's going to get you through. Because if you're like me, you're a kind person. You, Your love is like unconditional, <laughs> okay? You're forgiving, extremely forgiving, even when you're not supposed to be forgiving. I mean, we're not supposed to be, but even when you shouldn't forgive people, be so forgiving to people you are you have to focus on the bad stuff you have to focus on why this person is not the right one for you okay all right so the third tip of how to get out of a toxic relationship is going to be to heal heal your traumas okay heal 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 sing it with me now heal heal Heel, heel, a heel, heel, hey, heel, heel, hey, heel, heel. All right, but now for real, <laughs> y'all need to heal, okay? So you heard the saying, um, the best way to get over somebody to get to, to get under them. No, wrong advice, okay? That's why I'm in the situation that I'm in. <laughs> because I was avoiding being alone and so then I got into a relationship that I wasn't supposed to be in okay so don't be like me be like you and get over him okay let's do that so <laughs> you need to heal sis so whether that is um self-healing even though I feel like self-healing should be a secondary source of healing additional to like a primary source a primary source to me would be going to therapy having somebody else who is qualified and uh has the degree to back it up <laughs> and knows what they talking about okay that is the primary primary source okay so go to therapy because it helps because if you can't validate yourself something that i talked about in my last video y'all go watch it <laughs> if you can't validate yourself you need an external force to tell you oh your ex was wrong for doing that to you that wasn't fair like my therapist told me she was like that makes sense and i was like huh you're right that does make sense it makes a huge difference when you're healing when you are trying to get through your traumas okay go to therapy sis 10 out of 10 i recommend and so a secondary source would be uh self-healing so like reading self-help books um podcasts videos like this one shameless plug <laughs> self-help boom period so this is the fourth and final tip of how to get over your toxic boo, okay? Your ex boo. Let's just say ex boo, okay? We letting them go. 2021, no toxicity here. Roll up your sleeve for this one, okay? We're gonna roll up our sleeves, okay? Cause we get into it. We get into it. Okay, so tip number four is love your self okay sis love yourself okay do you hear me hold on let me come closer let me come closer can you hear me can you hear me now love yourself sis love yourself yes ma'am yes ma'am you need to love yourself okay because you need to love yourself. You need to love yourself. Ah! I'm gonna create a whole video on how to love yourself, 
okay? And when that video comes out, which will be soon, I'm gonna put it in this video right there or right here. It'll be up there somewhere. Go watch that video. Go ahead and click on that video. I'll give you two seconds. Click on it. Boom. That video is gonna tell you and tell you what you need to do to love yourself, okay? Love yourself, sis, okay? Get back to doing things. I'm gonna give you a little pre, a precursor. I'm gonna give you a little pre-screening of what I'm gonna talk about in this video. Get back to you. Practice self-love, okay? And self-love is not just, you know, getting your mani patty done or whatever, going on a shopping spree, because that's what I did yesterday, but don't tell nobody. <laughs> self-love is all of it, okay? Self-love is doing the work. Self-love is taking care of your business, okay? Self-love is taking care of your finances, okay? Self-care is taking care of your spiritual well-being, okay? Self-care is a, it's huge, it's huge. So I have to do a whole video on how to love yourself, self-love edition, okay? And that's gonna come right after this video, so. Go ahead and click one of these sides. I don't know what side it's gonna be on. It's probably gonna be on this side. No, this side, this side, this side, this side. All right, sis. I hope y'all had enough of me talking because y'all know I do like to talk a lot. You know, I'm gabbing me gabbing over here. I hope you got a lot out of this video. And if you didn't, let me know in the comments because I definitely do. I like um, criticism. Go ahead and let me know what I need to work on. Let me know if there's anything that you want to, any topic that you want to talk about in depth. Let's go ahead and get into it, okay? I'm also coming out with a podcast. It's coming out very, very soon, okay? So go ahead and leave your topics down below. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. Go ahead and share it with your friend who is trying to get over and out of a toxic relationship. Send this video to them and tell them this is for you, sis. I love you and you deserve better, okay? And if this person is you, and th this video is for you, I love you, and you deserve a whole lot better, okay? And that's on what? And that's on what? Mary had a lamb, period, okay? <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying half of the time. Anyways, I love y'all. I hope y'all have a beautiful day, and self-love is the best love oh make sure you like comment and subscribe okay sis because if you are not subscribed then what are you doing sis okay this is gems i'm dropping gems i'm just ooh, salt bay i'm gem bay over here let me stop not gem bay anyways i love y'all y'all have a good day peace out <laughs>